Hazrat Abu Huraira radiyallahu ta'ala anhu reports in Bukhari and Muslim that Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said that there was a person who had who had actually spent his life in all forms of transgression and disobedience and sins. This person did a great injustice to himself. And when the hour of his death drew near, he was seized with the fear of Allah. Because all of his neglig negligences in the life and because of all the even doings in his life. And then when before the time of his death, he called his sons and he instructed his sons that after his death, they should burn his body to ashes and scatter some of the ashes on land and some in water in the rivers. So when he died, his sons obeyed what he had asked them to do and they burned his dead body down to ashes and they actually uh, blew some of the ashes in the air and then put some of the ashes in the in a river and by Allah what happened then that immediately by the order of Allah there was a command of Allah the kalamaikun of Allah that remains of his dead body they were all gathered from the land and from water and he was resurrected and he was brought back to life and then Allah Azza wa Jal asked him why did you do that? That is why did you instruct your children to do that? And what did he answer? What did, did this person who had spent his life in disobedience, in sins, in transgression, committing all forms of sin, doing all forms of evil do do deeds, living leading all his life in all forms of negligence and disobedience, this person said, Oh my Allah, I did this only because I feared you. I couldn't face you. How could I face you with spending all these forms of life? This fear of Allah, Prophet ﷺ said, Allah pardoned him. And he was made to enter into Jannah. So this is the merit. This is the excellence of the feeling of fear of Allah.